Yo, what's up, Sog? Hey, it's Trump Saul. Um, making this video here on the La Muerta. Uh, so what it is, I have a video that I ran like two weeks ago when they were still giving out the Armada shit. Um, but since then, I've done it a lot better. I just never recorded it. Um, so I figure what I can do is just go through this and point out the little details that were changed uh, that make a fairly difference in the oil cost. So we'll just play it through and I'll kind of give some commentary on it as well. So this is for CC8. Uh, capacity is 1600. I got um, all level 8 Mercs with two level 10 Zeuses. And right here at the beginning, you want to spawn everybody all at once, right where I spawn those first two tanks. Um, just spawn them there with AI on. They won't take any damage whatsoever. As soon as they blow up that uh, flak, you can just pull them back. But they'll take out the salvo and all those troops without taking any damage. Uh, that's pretty fucking piss poor quality right now, but it should clear up here. Maybe I should have went 720. There we go. Okay. So with the um, Mercs, the main thing is just keep everybody together. Make sure our Zeus's are in the middle or at the rear somewhere. And uh, just keep them rolling. Don't click on anything. Just keep clicking in the open. Uh, you know, treat them just like Humvees. That way those Mercs shoot and drive at the same time. Um, now right here is the second point. Um, this barrier right there in front of the machine gun turret. Uh, if you click on it ahead of time, see if I can get my S pen out, there we go. If you click on it ahead of time, um, the mercs will all blow it up before that machine gun starts firing. And then once you roll over there, they'll start shooting it without having to worry about shooting the barrier while they're taking damage. And I also click everybody right down here then after that. That way it tucks them in, they blow that up real quick, and then they start shooting that. And nobody up here take, you know, starts firing yet. But so once they blow that up, just start moving everybody up here. Just keep the Zeus's in the back, the very back. Just move everybody up, let them take that out. Pretty much the same process here. Um, I think instead I was clicking right on the howitzer there and letting them take the howitzer out next. Um, that way they're not all getting damaged, you know, from that splash. Um, this is pretty self-explanatory through here. Same thing, same process. Um... If you want, you can click this barrier here to blow it up ahead of time as well. But um, I wouldn't recommend it at first. You just want to try going through quick your first couple times. Because uh, you do cut it close on time, especially your first couple runs. Um, and right there, go for that transformer very first. As soon as you drive these guys around, um, click the transformer first. Uh, blow it up. And then go for both them salvos. Click directly on them. And then once they blow themselves up, start driving. And they'll blow that flak up and those uh, strikers. So right here, you want to aim at that barrier. Make sure it's all blown up, everything in front of it. And then proceed to uh, roll the tanks forward just by clicking open spots. Now right here, I shouldn't have clicked right on that salvo. That way my tanks would at least kill the troops. And the other very important part right here. Where the fuck my play button go? There it is. So with my Reapers, I fucked up here. The Raptors, I'm sorry. So three Avengers on the Howitzer. And then them three Raptors, you want to have those clicked already. So like... God damn it. I don't know what the fuck is going on with this. So, matter of fact, once your tanks start to cross right here, you want to be dropping those Raptors. You, you want those Raptors... Uh, drop before these tanks start to move and click it right about in here because if you hit it just right those raptors will actually completely blow those tanks up as well so that's probably the biggest change right here so see I waited way too long that should have already been clicked in it should have been way further over to the left um, but yeah so that would have taken out those two tanks right there And same thing like everything else, just keep clicking on open areas, just let them drive and blow shit up. Keep the Zeus's in the back.
Now right here I click each tank individually, that way it blows them all up in order, and then uh, make sure you click right on this transformer. Your tanks will go around and blow it up without being in range of that uh, railgun, so you're good. So you'll see them blow it up right there. As soon as they do that, I click right on the railgun. That way they go up and blow it up, and then start them driving right away. Like I said, just always keep those Zeus's in the back. And as soon as your air is ready, then you want to start looking down here. See, I brought it up a little too soon because my Raptors weren't back yet. But now I can zoom back over here. Just keep them tanks rolling through everything. It's right here. Um, I wish I would have paused that in time. So with this air, I'll pause it here and click and show you exactly where to drop it. So you want to put your Avengers right on the flak. And then your Raptors, literally dead center of everything right there. Just click it right there. It'll blow all that stuff up. And then you don't have to worry about the boss chopper or any of these troops right here. So you'll see that happen. See, they take those three Avengers out always, but it's no problem. And the Raptors get shot up a little bit. But, uh, I mean, it's whatever. As long as you can beat this shit in one run... Who cares if it costs you 10,000 oil, you know? Because if you got 40k capacity, that's four runs. <laughs> and then this, just drive them all over, you know? Just make sure they blow everything up. I click them right on these uh, first. The only thing that fucked me over there before were those barriers got in the way. Um, so I know I always go through and hurry up and blow them up first. Because when I, when I did it before I came from up there... And that flak is left down here. And if you click it, your tanks, for whatever reason, want to drive the whole way out around that barrier. And it'll fuck your time up. But so you can see here, I took a good bit of damage. But that's just the basics of how to do it in one run. Um, pretty easy, like I said. Especially once you get the hang of it, uh, you'll fly through it. It's very simple. Hope that helps everybody out. Um, we'll show the oil cost here. But like I said, now... Uh, with running it the way pretty much exactly how I just explained um, I think now I've got it down the lowest I did it was like 4500 oil but that was, was pretty rare it's usually right around 5000 5500 so you know I'm sure it can be done much better um, but like I said that's just pretty much a guaranteed run right there so I hope that helps you guys take it easy